On most newer unibody chassis, there's a significant amount of bracing or webbing between the tops of the struts and the main chassis or the bulkhead behind the engine. That's something that's kind of been developed over the years as that kind of car structure was used. The 240 model was at the beginning of that kind of structure and one of the things they felt was that it could use a little bit more bracing. One of the things that came out of Volvo and our friends in Sweden was the upper GT chassis braces which actually bolt in between the top of the struts and the firewall to give a little bit of extra bracing. This was included on some of the GT models in the late 70s but is something you can add to virtually any Volvo 240. If you have any questions just give us a call.